What is going on YouTube? My name is Lucas and today I'm gonna take you to school. No, like that's what the stock's gonna be about. Taking you to school. And it's gonna be on Chegg Inc. That's right. And it's actually a very awesome stock. And I'm really excited to bring you this one because I do think we're moving towards the future with it. But it's also helping out kids during the coronavirus and it's helping out high schoolers get into college and it's really unique. So I felt like I should bring the stock to you guys. So if you're interested, stay tuned right after this. Before I... <laughs> I don't even know if I can get that one out. Before I educate you on this stock, I ask that you guys smash that subscribe button, smash that like button, comment down below, and now it's time to get into this video. Really excited to provide you guys with this stock, and the reason is I'm gonna give you a quick rundown real quick. Um, my actual bachelor's degree is in elementary education, and I minored in coaching, and that was always a passion of mine. And that's actually kind of what led me to do YouTube. You know, I was, I taught kindergarten through sixth grade at, in computers. And, you know, it led me to other adventures, obviously. I, I joined the military and from there, it just took me down a different path. But that, I feel deep down is what led me to YouTube. I constantly want to, you know, educate and help provide a service to anyone who watches my videos. You know, I want to, you know, help them understand the stock market. I want to help them understand stocks that are doing well. And really, I just enjoy talking to people in the manner of, you know, teaching and educating and just helping out in any way I possibly can. And I really think that that's what helped me, you know, when it came to educating our youth was the excitement I could see when they would be successful at something. And, and it really was self-gratifying because you're helping them understand whatever it is and then they continue to grow and grow and you know they moved on from there and so i think that's why i kind of have a personal attachment with this stock that i'm going to provide you chegg inc you know what's unique about it is to me it sounds like they focus a lot on high school and i think what's really cool about chegg is that a part of the deal it sounds like you know they do a internship and i think an internship is something that is irreplaceable a lot of the time you learn the hands-on you learn the ins and outs of the job of people that have been doing it for years you see how it's done and you learn from people who have been doing it for years you know and then you take what you can from them those types of people and you apply them to yourselves or you modify what you learn and you take that into the next step a lot of the time internships turn into actual jobs at that internship if not you tack that onto your resume, what you learned, you know, maybe some skill set you learned, you apply that to your, you know, your um, resume and you go to the next job. So I think that's a very, very unique service that Chegg provides. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to really dive in and tell you what Chegg does. So I'm going to swing on over here. Chegg Inc. is a student first connected learning platform. The company helps students study for college admission exams find the colleges, get grades and test scores while in school and find internships that allow them to gain skills to help them enter the workforce after college. Like I said, that is a very unique service. The company matches domestic and international students with colleges, universities and other academic institutions in the United States. It also offers e-textbooks library for rent and sale, which I'm going to hit on, you know, it's going to continue talking about that, but I'm going to hit on that here in a little bit. Um, it says that the company also has live tutors on its connected learning platform available to students online anytime, anywhere through its Chegg service, you know, tutor service. It provides access to internships to help students gain skills that are critical to securing the first job. It offers two product lines, required material and Chegg services. The required materials product line includes the rental and sell of print textbooks and e-textbooks as well as the commission it received from Ingram. So as you guys can see, this company really does provide a great service to the youth. And you know, there's other companies out there and eventually I'm going to get to those into another video. One that pops off mine is K12 and 
um, and I think that kind of provides a very unique service as well but that's gonna be for another video the coronavirus really did impact this stock but it impacted it in a positive way and I think as humans we learn to adapt to negative things that are thrown at us you know especially in this way we obviously have a pandemic that just ran rampant across the world and this company obviously sprung onto the scene and it helped our youth continue to get that education that they need so that they can continue to take it even further you know not obviously everyone goes to college you know some people go to trade school some people join the military you know once we graduate high school we all go different avenues and that's the unique thing about you know the route we choose and how we choose our jobs and what we're interested in but this is just a way to provide our youth with another opportunity to continue growing and get to that next level at which they see and speaking of that i'm going to talk to you about the subscribers that have been joining and the rapid number of growth that chegg is showing so swinging on over here it says subscribers for chegg services surged 67 percent to 3.7 million in the second quarter the june acquisition of mathway expanded chegg's reach to more subscribers as the math problem solving app has a presence in about 100 countries and its services are localized in 12 languages indeed chegg saw unprecedented demand in the second quarter resulting in more subscribers in the quarter than in the entire 2018 and i think that that's very unique because i'm sure this company is continuously trying to expand and obviously being in multiple multiple countries that's only going to help revenue but it's helping the world grow you know and that's just a positive thing they're doing research on things like this because i understand that these are important you know programs for our youth like i keep stating i mean this is a huge benefit to the kids that may not necessarily get to go to school or have that opportunity to do something like this so i'm gonna continue to provide you you know a different avenue at which you know chegg is constantly progressing and one of the you know after doing the research i think this is truly the only company that has an e textbook and a, an actual hardbound textbook a company applied to them and so i'm going to give you that information it says a widespread at-home college experience is the kind of shift that education platform company chegg inc could only have dreamed of chegg is widely known for selling and renting textbooks but most of its revenue now comes from selling study materials and services to high school and college students including for online tutoring because the textbook business is highly competitive and price sensitive chegg's growth potential is mainly in the latter segment so as you can see it probably does benefit this company when you're talking about you know study guides and online programs and things like that but then you're also all in the same place you know that the textbooks you're going to be purchasing are going to go along with the courses that you're taking i know when i was in college that was one of the hardest things is being able to match serial numbers with the books you need for the classes that you were taking and you wanted to make sure it was the right one but you didn't want to spend top dollar there was just a lot that went into purchasing textbooks and then vice versa you go to sell it and you weren't getting the money that you you know definitely put into it so i think that a service like this that is connected to chegg is very very beneficial time to talk business and actually what this stock is valued at and how they're doing in their quarterly earnings so swinging over here to really provide you that information so it says while the company has posted solid revenue growth over the past three years its recent run was remarkable revenue in the quarter ended june 30th surging 63 percent from a year earlier to 153 million and the number of subscribers grew 67 percent by the students need for support as many schools move to remote learning obviously coronavirus Chegg upped its guidance and now expects third quarter revenue to be at least 48.6 percent higher than a year earlier and full year revenue to grow by 47 percent or more does Chegg's guidance look ambitious yes it is a stretch not really last quarter's growth was impressive but total subscription numbers were 3.7 million a small piece of the 54 million addressable english speaking high school and college student mark market excuse me an extended period of limited on-campus resources only heightens the need for online educational support 
The year's first quarter, coming before the full impact of the school closures, saw Chegg notch year-over-year revenue growth of more than 35%. You know, and I think this is going to be a stock that continuously grows, and they're going to continuously show that the revenue is going to continue to climb. They're going to obviously continue to gain more subscribers, and because that's just the direction at which we're headed. Obviously, there's going to be a lot of students going back to school, and that's currently happening in some states, and I'm sure that's happening across the world. But there's still going to be some that are always going to need these resources. And so for them to pop out during a pandemic like this is just awesome. On top of that, these are companies that are going to continuously grow and expand because we're talking education. So there's always probably the next step at how can we get better at what we're doing? How can we provide an even better service to the students to make them more knowledgeable, to make it more fun, to make them have better interaction, keeping them engaged, and then you know taking that next step, getting that internship at maybe a major, major business, getting the job through the internship because of the program like this. There's just a lot of opportunity for companies like this and you know, it may not show that ever in the stock price, it, but it's going to show with our youth. And I think that's what's most important. I've come to my favorite part of any video, and that is chart breaking down time. So let's dive on into this education on this chart that is on Chegg. So on Friday, it opened at $68.95. It got as high as $69.76. Its low was $63.52, its volume was $4.078 million, its market cap is $8.731 billion, 52 week high is $89.82, its 52 week low is $25.89, and its average volume is $3.644 million. It closed Friday at $67.94, that was down 2.80%. It climbed just a hair in the after hours, closing out the week at $68 even, up 0.03%. Now this is a six month chart. I'm gonna continue showing you guys six month charts until March disappears, because obviously it's very important to see how the coronavirus impacted individual stocks and companies. In this case, it is a positive impact. You know, March, and leading into April, it was just kind of staying consistent. And then, you know, this stock really started getting introduced. It sprung onto the market. It had great quarterly earnings and it shot way up and just continued to stride. I think once more people found out about this, it started gaining more subscribers. Obviously they have their own textbooks and e-textbooks. I think that this is just an all one in one service. Whatever the stock does, I think it's going to be awesome for the people who invest in this. You know, I'm really looking into this, but I think the biggest picture is that it's helping and providing a service that is just undoubtedly important to the world. It's providing an education and it's helping our youth get to the next step. And that's what's important. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and really hopefully you dive into this company and just take a look and see what that kind of service they provide and if you're interested invest in the company i do want to remind you guys i am not a financial advisor and anything i say in this video is for entertainment purposes only which is what i try to do entertain you and you guys know how i do it if you like this video smash that like button it helps out tremendously and if you enjoy the content because i'm gonna keep the content flowing subscribe to my youtube channel and as always have a good day